Hey guys, it's Ashley and I am filming a red lip tutorial with just a simple clean eye. Black eyeliner, lashes, and a red lip go together like mashed potatoes and gravy or uh, spaghetti and meatballs. You more comfortable with that analogy? Name the movie and I'll love you forever. Um, so yeah, keep on watching, make sure to like the video and subscribe to my new channel and yeah, I will see you guys soon in the next video. Bye! So for a red lip, I'm going up for a night out on the town. I'm going to want to use a primer and I'm using MAC Gal because it's going to give me a nice glowing finish. I'm putting on my foundation first with my fingers just to warm up my foundation. Then I'm pressing it in with my beauty blender which is damp. I'm using Makeup Forever HD. The reason being because it does not have SPF in it, which means when you take pictures, you're not gonna get a flash face, that kind of washed out white look. So this is a really great foundation when wearing um, for like a formal evening, any night you're gonna be taking a ton of pictures. This is a beautiful foundation which is gonna give you a gorgeous, gorgeous finish. Next, the end all be all of concealers, MAC Pro Longwear. I'm pushing it underneath my eyelids, on top of my eyelids to prime for eyeshadows, around my nose, anywhere I have redness or need extra coverage. Now I'm just gonna set my foundation and my concealer with one of my favorite drugstore finds, Rimmel Stay Matte, Stay Matte Powder. And this I'm just setting in my T-zone, concealer areas around my mouth, anywhere I'm going to be having a lot of movement where I would normally crease. So um, just around my mouth, around my nose, um, concealer areas, cheekbones, that sort of thing. Okay, down to the nitty gritty. Let's get down to eyes. So first we're going to do the, uh, the brow highlight. I'm using Balance Type by MAC. Um, this is just going right underneath my brows. This is just a vanilla shade. Um, you can use any um, plain, non-shimmer uh, vanilla tone eyeshadow for this. Now I'm going to take um, Cork from MAC. You can use any soft brown shadow and I'm just going to take that right in my crease of my eye. Um, and I'm just going to take that in a windshield wiper motion back and forth, back and forth over and over and over and over. Now the key to any eyeshadow look is blending, ladies. You've got to blend, blend, blend. So when you think you're not done yet and you feel like it just looks like crap and you're not, you're not um, getting the fill that you want, it means you probably haven't blended enough. Just blend, blend, blend. So after this windshield wiper motion that I'm doing back and forth, back and forth, I'm going to take my next shadow, which is All That Glitters. This is just kind of a champagne-y, neutral, um, glittery color, and I'm going to put that all over my lids, and I'm just going to press that right onto my lid, taking it right up into my crease, but I'm not going to rub it into my crease because it can accentuate any wrinkles that you have. So I'm just going to push that onto my eyelids. Okay, next I'm using my Maybelline Gel Eyeliner in Blackest Black, and I'm using a Sigma brush just to put that on both eyes, and now I'm going to be using my e.l.f. mascara. You guys, this mascara is $2. Hallelujah! And then I'm going to be grabbing my Ardell Natural Lashes, and I'm using the black toned glue and putting this on both of my eyes. And then once I put on both eyelashes, I'm going to run through both of my eyes, bottom and top lashes once again with that e.l.f. mascara. Now I'm just sharpening up my eyeliner with my Kat Von D liquid eyeliner and I'm going to contour adding with some blush. This is Hoola and I'm going right underneath my cheekbones, right along my hairline. I'm not doing a really strict contour, this is just like a light bronzing. And then I'm gonna be taking my NARS blush in the shade Orgasm, um, and my um, MAC highlighter in, I believe that is Soft and Gentle. I'll put it in the description bar down below. I'm putting the um, blush just right above my arch 
of my eyebrow as well. It gives your face just a beautiful glow. I love it. Okay, I slowed this part down just because I feel like so many women are scared of lip liner. This is just a NYX red lip liner and I took it and I rubbed it on the back of my hand just to get it warm. I'm going to follow the natural lines of my lip just to get the outline of my lip and then I'm going to fill in my entire lip. Do small strokes ladies, don't try and fill in your whole lip all at once with one line. If you're new to lip liner, you're probably going to mess up and that's okay. Just take a little bit of concealer on a brush and just sharpen up your edges and clean up with that concealer. It just acts like a little eraser. My very last step is taking Russian Red by MAC. This is just a very neutral, beautiful red lipstick that fits every single person. It has a blue base, it's really going to make your teeth look white, and I'm just applying that right on top of my red lip liner. I hope you guys like this look. Make sure to subscribe to my channel, like the video, and we'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching.